Hong Kong is, is considering allowing spot bit Bitcoin ETF in the hope of creating an Asian digital asset hub. Bitcoin spot ETFs are hoped for by the crypto general public as the next bull run initiator. However, an example from Netherlands, where Europe's first spot BTC ETF was approved, uh, shows us a different story. Just a friendly reminder to the crypto community. If you are using the Ledger recovery service, you are signing for a simple transfer of funds if Ledger willingly or unwillingly due to government pressure decides to collaborate with one of the other storage providers as Ledger owns the common crypto key. Not your keys, not your crypto. According to on-chain data, Fresh Wallet was, has withdrawn over 40, 412 million USDT from the Tether Treasury since October 20th and is depositing them to Coinbase, Kraken, OKX and HTX. You can check transfers in the comment below. Reddit and CBDC new feature. After many features of CBDC and social credit like freezing account, CO2 related spending control, using CBDC only within certain perimeters, maximum amount on account settings, etc. There is another social fe feature from China. If you are within 500 meters of a person with a low social credit score, the application will remind you to run away to greater distance. Otherwise, your own social score will be lowered too. Is there still anybody here defending CBDC? Swiss sent Galler Cantonal Bank to offer Bitcoin and Ethereum custody services. Just reminding that the, there are AOPP travel rule is being actively enforced by Switzerland by FINMA. Boeing negotiations with hackers obviously failed, as Boeing data is back on the Logbit leak site and is going to be published. Funny fact, Blixt Wallet allows you to change language to Klingon. However, non-Klingon speaking users are reporting huge problems changing it back to anything else, as you have to scroll down settings completely in Klingonese. According to Tether, Qu uh, Q3 attestations underlying assets consist of over 83 billion in total assets, from which over 70 billion in T-bills, 1.7 billion in Bitcoin, 3.1 billion in gold and 3.7 billion in others. UK bank NatWest is telling customers to reduce their carbon footprint, eat vegetarian and stop drinking dairy milk after scanning their transaction data.